everyone, how are you today? My name is Sania Rahmatika. My name is Elma Ziaretil Ulya. Hello, my name is Malika Romaiza Putri. Hello everyone, my name is Fabi Elfani Mukhayaro. Hello guys, my name is Budiana Fristanti Maulida. We are from group 4. Today, we will invite you to join our class. In this session, we will talk about a favorite idol using descriptive text. Our group used genre-based learning that combined with think pair share method, and we use scientific approach as the approach. And now, let's move to the class. Okay, student, in the previous meeting, we have learned about descriptive text and today we will describe about our favorite idol. So, who is your favorite idol? Why you choose them? And how would you describe the physical appearance of your idol? I will show you some idol photos and take a moment to observe the following images. Okay, have done. Among the individuals depicted, who is your idol? Could you elaborate on why you hold them in high regret? Alright, let's get started. We're going to form six groups. So, everyone, please count off to six. Okay, six groups have been formed. Now, please everyone gather with your own respective groups. Okay, so is everyone already on their own group? Okay everyone, now it's time for gallery walk. Each group will take turn to exploring the pictures on the wall and elaborate and also brainstorming vocabulary related to physical appearance like face, hair, and also skin color and everything that comes to your mind. Okay, everyone, take turns. Don't forget to take turns and good luck. As you walk around, jot down any words that comes to your mind. Remember, this is about critical thinking and please think outside the box. This is your chance to contribute and discover new words that you might not have heard before and you might not have encountered before. Good luck everyone! Okay everyone, time for gallery walk is up. Right now, please get back to your own chair and discuss with your group about the vocabulary that you've already mentioned before. Discuss about the meaning of the vocabulary that you found and also please share your interpretation whether you all agree with each other perspective or not. Okay, are you done? Okay, right now, let's try to pronounce together. We will try how to pronounce these words that you've already mentioned with the right pronunciation. Please repeat after me. For example, Hansen. Please repeat after me, Hansen. Okay, cheerful. Good. Good. And then pretty. Okay, everyone. Good job. Okay, everyone. Moving to the next activity, we're going to have like a matching task. I have some pieces of paragraphs of descriptive text about Putri Marino for each of you. And I also have some pieces of general structures of the text so i want you to think to consider to observe to identify which paragraph is introduction physical description personality description and also conclusion so let's get started and i will give you a few minutes maybe around five until seven minutes to think about these pieces and match them as possible as you can Okay everyone, time is up. I'm sure that you have already observed and identified the paragraphs and also their structures. 
So now I want you to discuss with your partner, with your chairmate. Just take a moment to share, to discuss about your observations, your findings, what's going on in your mind. Great job, everyone. After sorting the paragraphs, did you find any difficult words from the text? If you did, you can write them down on your notebooks and then later while you are presenting your findings in the full class you you can share the difficult words you found in the text and then your friend will help you in providing the meaning of the words all right everyone i think i'm sure you you have already done in writing the difficult words you found in the text so now it's time for each group to present your results, your findings to the whole class and just feel free to share any difficult words uh, to your friends and let's all give and pay attention to the presenters and then let's just help each other to finding and giving the meanings of the challenging words. Okay, good job everyone. Thank you for sharing for your activeness for your cooperation in sharing your findings and results in the discussion okay my students in today's statement we use idle pictures as inspiration you to write descriptive text make sure you choose an image that really motivate and inspire you All of you, please pay attention. Here, each group has to choose one ideal character that you like the most from these pictures. Then consider carefully and discuss with your group members about the reason why you choose the item. After choosing the ideal picture, your task is to write a descriptive text about the idol you have chosen. Write the text in at least three paragraphs. Explain why you choose the idol and how it has affected you. Before you start your writing, Make sure you all understand the instruction well. Okay, is there anything that is not clear or that needs to be explained further? Okay, now it's time to start your writing your descriptive text. Work on this task with enthusiasm and collaboration with your group members. Good luck everyone! Okay student, the time is up. I hope you are all finished. And now I will call one of you to come and present the descriptive text you made. I will call Michelle and Michelle, please come. Okay Michelle, thank you for your presentation. The descriptive text that Michelle present sounds so good, right? So, please give applause for her. Okay, students, so I think enough for our class today. Don't forget to do your homework and see you on the next meeting. Thank you. Okay everyone, I think enough from our group today. Sorry for the mistake we made. Thank you for watching. See you on the next video and session. And bye bye. bye, -bye.